let's start with uh, some sad news. We made jokes for years about Liza Minnelli and her marriage to David Guest, but this is not funny. Uh, David Guest, Liza's now ex-husband, um, found dead in a London hotel room yesterday at the age of 62. What was the cause? He was the oddest looking man. Yeah. Oh. Remember the kiss? Oh, yeah. When they got mm-hmm. married? Yeah, it was like, no, it was just... Uh, yeah, it, it was, was just really r- bizarre. Yeah, and if you don't know, I mean, the rumor was always that he was not r- into women. Right. right. There you go. <laughs> was so, he gay? Uh, the marriage <laughs> lasted for five years. Uh, but here's a weird thing. So he was on Celebrity Big Brother in the UK. And so was this girl, Tiffany Pollard. She was uh, New York on, what was it? She was on Flavor of Love. Yeah. Or something, some VH1 reality show back in the day that no one even remembers remembers her name, but she was on Celebrity Big Brother. Well, earlier this year when she was on the show with David Guest, someone came up to her and said, David is dead. And she broke down crying. She thought it was David Guest, but it turned out it was David Bowie. So she started selling these shirts on her website that said, David is dead. Like a joke about, well, she had to pull those down yesterday. <gasps> That's in poor taste. Wow. Ooh. Yeah. That's a good way to make money, though. Yeah, right. (laughs) Yeah. Megan Fox and more about her pregnancy. We talked yesterday about how she's expecting her third child, and we believe that it was Brian Austin Green's baby, even though the two of them are in the middle of a divorce. Yesterday, she threw up some pictures on social media of her with all of her co-stars like Will Arnett, Shia LaBeouf, Jake Johnson from New Girl, um, and hashtagged it, not the father. It's classy. I'm telling yeah. you. She has said that it's Brian Austin Green's baby, but she's still going through with the divorce. Which. Ah, oh, love. <laughs> right? Not love. Ah, uh, not Our love. <laughs> <laughs> right. Maybe just keep it to yourself. I mean, this baby is eventually going to be able to get on the interwebs and learn all about. The, what, the circumstances surrounding its yeah, arrival. Not if it has Megan Green smarts. <laughs> I mean, Megan. Fox. I said Megan Green. Well, that's his. Well, I yeah, know. I, I, yeah. I know. Yeah. yeah. Hope that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Eric Stone Street plays Cam on Modern Family and who's from Kansas City, the Kansas City area. Uh, he was on Ellen yesterday talking about dating and he revealed that he's on a dating app. Yes, I have a Tinder account. Do you all know what Tinder is? Yeah. yeah. The way I justified it, Ellen, is like, I shouldn't be, because I'm on TV, I shouldn't be eliminated from participating in, like, what's going on in the world. No. But people but people are always like, I can't believe you're on, on a dating app. It's like, well, you know, I never, I very rarely meet people because I get nervous. But really? Well, yeah, I get nervous. Well, I mean, that's the place you wouldn't get nervous. No, I mean to actually meet them. I'm oh. not nervous to, like, chat yeah. with them. And... and how many have you met? Hmm? <laughs> He uh, went on to say he's met several women through the Tinder app. Can you imagine that, though? You no, know, you're, you're like you're scroll- on, scrolling. Yeah, or? yeah, you know. No, well, well, I, oh, Tinder is, yeah, you it's do see slide. the face, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, that's right. So you see the face. And you're like, haha, who used Eric Stone Street's picture as exactly. their profile right. pic? You know. Or, you know, one of those websites where it's anonymous and you show up and it's some celebrity. Right. <laughs> Why, where's the camera? <laughs> you know. He's not the only celebrity to use Tinder. Hillary Duff used Tinder. Although we found out later she did, like, a music video, too. So it might have been a big publicity stunt because her music video, she's, like, dating all these random guys, swiping left and right on Tinder. I don't remember which way you... I guess it's a good thing that I don't know which way you swipe on Tinder if you like somebody. I'm saying right. Left feels like it's out. Like yeah. Get out. <laughs> yes. Swipe right. <laughs> Stay over here to this side. You go that way. New Indiana Jones movie, although fans are bumming because the producer says that the new movie is going to continue on from The Kingdom of the Crystal Skull, the last one that people did not like at all. Uh, Shia LaBeouf apparently will not be part of it, but it's going to come out in July of 2019, just before Harrison Ford turned 77. Wow. Damn. It's like Sean Connery when he started getting older, right? You know, he started, ta- you know, these roles that he started taking. I'm not talking about 007, but when he started taking some of these older roles and then finally just said, screw it, I'm not yeah, going to be in I'm any more tired. movies. I'm done. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, he, Harrison Ford proved with Star Wars that he can still he can still do it. Mm-hmm. Um, but spoiler alert, he has a lot of time on his hands now. So, um, And speaking of Star Wars, Han Solo jacket, he auctioned off 
a Han Solo jacket from the latest Star Wars film, and it benefited two different charities. Uh, the auction is finally over. After some intense bidding, it went for $191,000. Oh, that is just insanity. I don't know if you. He signed the jacket. I'll too. sell all of my jackets for that. <laughs> <laughs> what's your What's your most prized jacket? Mine. That you have? Yeah. Oh man, I got one that I think I got at Oak Tree. <laughs> it's got mustard yellow sleeves. <laughs> it's probably a members only. <laughs> yeah, right. If you bought it, it at Oak Tree, it um, might be. I don't know. Members only, I think, was maybe pri- primarily Chess King. So <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> I think you were right. I think you some good money for that lumpy lobsters jacket. No, oh I've... my gosh, so you that would go. For a, People really like that jacket. Yeah. Right. Pretty penny. Except for guys. Yeah. <laughs> Even Lumpy's jacket didn't fit me. You can see it online. Guy uh, modeling it in the Justin Bieber Sorry video. That's yeah. uh, at but Y98.com. You, but you don't want to do that because you like me. Y98.com. You don't want to spoil the, the, you know, the relationship we have. That's I a- like him. Oh, my God. <laughs> I can't listen to him anymore. More Schmig at 840 on Y98. The fil- 